Red. red. Um, waxy. Round red. Waxy. Uh, sweet. You know, uh, juicy. They're using their five senses to tell you what an apple is. If you have an intuitive person and you ask them to describe an apple, they might say things like, Apples remind me of apple Get out my face. They remind me of grandma. Baking all those apple pies. What are you doing? I get this warm no, no, feeling no. when I think of that. What a weird. <laughs> when I think of apples, I think of grandma. What are you doing? <laughs> when you like. It's my journal. Your prophet, prophet said you have to keep a journal, right? Yeah. And Bishop said this is a, this is just as good as keeping a journal. That's a good journal. I have I have my own like institute journal and like scripture journal, you know. But this is a pretty cool journal. Yeah, and then it's actually like more real. Then put it on YouTube. Hopefully YouTube doesn't get shut down. Really <laughs> <laughs> bad. Yeah, dance to music. <laughs> Can you see all the cheese? It's all cheese. Yeah. We're at the cheese shop. The cheese shop in Newcastle, and it's supposed to be really good, so we're trying it for the first time. Okay. What's that, Dan? It's a lot of cheese. It's a lot of cheese. Newcastle okay, so cheese shop. So, yeah, good. Good. Very good. Uh, I would recommend the cheese shop in Newcastle, California. Um, off of Main Street. Just drive around Newcastle, it's not very big. Drive around Main Street till you find it. Um, windows going down. And yeah, it's really good. I, I've never had habanero jack cheese before, and it's fantastic. Let me tell you. And there's a gelato bar too if you wanted that. Yum. So my dad just ran over a construction guy. What? It was pretty embarrassing. Knock it off. What? <laughs> he, he, I was just like, Dad, why'd you do that? And he's like, he got in my way. Hey, hi, what's up? This is Brandon, and I'm backing up. Backing up! Backing up! Backing up! Turning the wheel. Well, that was the biggest backup I've ever done. Lifeguard training, day four. Sorry, it's kind of loud. Lifeguard training, day four. Um, we're supposed to implement everything into the workstation today, or not workstation, but the the rescue series, I guess. So you have to find the person, rescue them, get them out of the water, and then do the CPR if necessary, or the rescue breathing, all that kind of stuff. So let's do this, this should be fun. And then we have one more day tomorrow, which is gonna be an eight hour day. Ooh. Anyways, later. Ace is complaining right now. <laughs> Ah! Whoa, it's not focusing. Oh, there we go. Whoa, Devin, you like appeared out of nowhere. I actually walk. <laughs> Why does Garrett always walk out right when I turn the camera on? I think he's just like a kid movie star. Yeah. It's like, ah, oh, Garrett's here. Sensor. Hey, hi, what's up? This is Brandon, and I'm not backing up. I am going to the last day of. I've got training, I've got training day five, and it's really, oh, I'm kind of late, that's why I'm not backing up, or because I'm in a hurry, but it's going to be an eight hour day today, and so hopefully this goes over well, and we're doing test outs today, and so I hope I don't fail. Alright, yeah, okay, see you there. I passed my driver, swimming test, passed my swimming test, woohoo, woohoo. Tyler's back there if you can see him. I don't know. Anyways, pass all the swimming tests, CPR, equipment, uh, rescues, and water extrication. So sweet, sorry it's loud, but yeah. Alright, bye. We have to be there in half now. Look at that gorgeous there. face. Ew! <laughs> <laughs> is this for your vlog? Yes, yeah, this is for my vlog. What? What are you vlogging? Video vlog. It's, it's like a journal. Are you remembering this moment in time forever? Yeah. You just well, passed your lifeguard you. test. Yes! It was so good! Yeah! You're not fantastic. for the written and the solo yeah. no, CPR. Not for the hard part. I did not study for that. I'm gonna die. Okay, I'm gonna go no. now. Bye. Bye, right, Claire. See, told you I passed. Ha! Yeah. 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 Say hello! Okay, who doesn't like. Okay. Um, sorry, I forgot to warn you this picture's graphic. Okay, bye. Um, so we're 
Yeah. We're almost to test time. Test time. We're, gonna, we're all gonna pass, so we're not really worried. Right, Tanner? He's not gonna pass. He totally just doesn't even want to. I will pass. Yes. You will more than pass. You better. Everybody's studying super hard. See all their books and stuff. See, he's studying super hard. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's a fly. Oh no, it's on you, Matt. Hit it. Get it. Oh, now it's on Claire's nose. No! Oh, blood! <laughs> <laughs> oh. What do you guys do? Bloody nose. Yeah. Bloody, Bloody nose. nose. Lean forward and pinch the bridge of your nose. Okay, so this is Timmy the Tomato. And um, he comes to our park. And this is going to help you go through some of the first aid injuries that are commonly um, occurring here at our facility, the ones that you're going to deal with probably the most. And uh, Timmy the Tomato, he's one of those rambunctious kids that goes just running through the park everywhere and you're always whistling, hey slow down, hey slow down, hey slow down, they don't care because they're a little kid and um, they just keep going. And um, the first injury, it's kind of hard to demonstrate because they don't have a good concrete on, um, but we'll say this trash can. So he falls and he scrapes his knee. There we go. Okay, got a little bit to come off. What kind of injury is that called? <coughs> Alright, so... Um... <laughs> um, this was the last day of lifeguard training, and so we did the test out today, and I did good on those, and then we went over to the other place, the Sunsplash place, and then we did the written exam, which I'm not too sure I did so well on, so hopefully I pass, I'll find out tomorrow, and that'll tell me, and then I do the CPR test, and then I know if I'm an actual lifeguard or not, so let's hope.